Hi, and welcome to this video. Let's see how you can auto lip sync in Blender. Grease Pencil. Hello everyone, welcome to this video. And this is exactly what we're going to do in this video. To get started, open up a new file. Draw your character. I'm going to draw a very simple one. Now, I'm going to select the eyes. And I'm going to move it to a new layer by pressing M. Now let's call this layer Eyes. Duplicate the mouse, right click, and here to salt fill as a material. Now move this new circle to a new layer and call it inside and this circle move it to a new layer call it mouth right now there's this layer called lines which you're going to call it head You can also add a new layer and draw. Teeth in it. And another layer, draw the bottom teeth. Now, turn on masks for both of these teeth layers. And let's mask it on mouse the inside. Name these two layers to make the process easier. Great. Now let's add the lattice. Scale it up so the head of the character fits in it. Looks good. Now duplicate it, scale it down, move it. And set the resolution of this smaller lattice to 3. Great. Now select your character. Go to Modifier Properties panel. Add Modifier of Lattice. Now duplicate it two times. Choose the object, lattice, layer, head. Next modifier, choose a smaller lattice as the object, and 
For the layer, you're going to choose mouth. Again, choose a small lattice, but this time, set layer to mouth inside. Let's see if it works correctly. Yes. Now, select the small lattice. Go to object data properties and add two shape keys. Mark the very top of the mouth using the nut tool and try closing the mouth. Now move it up so it reaches this mark. Let's test if it works correctly, and it does, but we don't want the mouth to close. And the value is set it to 1. We want it to be open that time. So, move key 1 to the top, select bases relative to key 1. Now, so maybe we want it to be. Select the bigger lattice, two shed keys, mark the very top of the head. Go to edit mode. And there. Again, move key one to the top, basis relative to key one. Great. Now select the small lattice, right click on value, copy as the driver, select the bigger lattice, right click on value, paste driver. Now try opening the mouth, jaw. It's animated too. Now let's try moving the bottom teeth. Click on your character. Add an offset modifier. Influence layer teeth down. Now right click Z, position Z, and paste driver. Right click again, edit driver, show in driver's editor.
work for out with it until you're satisfied with the results. I think that's good. Now to animate it, add video team workspace and also animation workspace. Control tab to sit between dump shit and graph editor. Now go to frame zero. Let me add another shape Q2. S, X, zero. Now, with bases and Q2, both keyframe. In the graph editor, select them, key, bake sound to F curves. Just like that. Now, I'm going to click on value key 2, modifiers and modifier, nose, blend type, multiply. Go to video editing tab and here you're going to import your sound. Now let's test. Hi, and welcome to this video. Let's see how you can auto lip sync in Blender. Grease pencil. That works really well. Hi, and welcome to this video. Let's see how you can auto lip sync in Blender. Grease pencil. And this is it. Thanks for watching, please like, share and subscribe to my channel, Atisa Colors. Goodbye!